that's why we recruit, right? <laughs> Shoot, so we just don't depend on one guy. No, um, hate that anybody, you know, isn't able to yeah. participate because of, you know, something that happened. I like that he took, took responsibility and, uh, you know, now it's time to move on. You know, he knows that he needs to move on and, and uh, make improvements so that he can play with us next year. And we know that we need to move on because Texas, Nevada, Michigan State don't care who lines yeah. up a tight end. You know, that, that's him, though. He's passionate. You know, you can see that. He loves Notre Dame. He loves being here. Um, and so uh, that passion, that's what's made him successful throughout his life now, you know, as a high school player. He made a mistake like we all have in our time, and he's going to benefit from it. So, uh, you know, he's going to get through it and, and be a better man. Yeah, I think they're both uh, – really improving. So Wisher was a retro freshman last year. First of all, did a great job, Coach Longo and his staff, really uh, improving his strength and his stamina, you know, his work volume. I think that was an issue uh, last year and this year, getting in the weight room with Coach Longo and with his staff did a great job. And then also he's more comfortable in the system now. He's a guy that, you know, is this year two in our system and uh, he's, he's comfortable. Durham, um, you know, quite frankly, I mean, recruiting Durham, thought that he was an elite tight end and uh, his arrow was pointed up last year um, during camp. He had a little bit of an injury during camp and then uh, he got injured during the, during the season. This year he stayed injury free. He's been productive during, uh, during our, uh, our 13 practices and uh, look forward to him continuing to be productive. I think he's a mature guy, mature body um, that can do a lot of things for us.